From the visitor center, we took South Boundary Road around to the west side of the park. There is a nice pull-off at the Presque Isle River so you can take pictures and enjoy this amazing view. This is also the south end of the Presque Isle River Trail and where you cross and turn north back to the parking lot. Okay, so this morning we are going to do the Presque Isle River Loop, and it is, here we go, we are starting here at the parking lot, we're going to cross over the bridge and see one, two, three falls, then cross over, this is like a regular bridge, and then come back on the other side, and I understand there's some boardwalks in here, and then finish up back at the car. So that's our plan for today. Let's go see some waterfalls. Okay, so we just started the Presque Isle Loop Trail and from the parking lot, the one closest to Superior. Boy, is this a beautiful trail. Okay, so we hit the boardwalk and we're gonna come down some stairs to the walking person bridge. And boy, these are really nice. Beautiful but dangerous. Waterfalls and swift river currents cause dangerous undertoes and deep holes in the river bottom. Stay on the trails. Rocks are slippery when wet. Even best swimmers can drown if they fall in the river. And enjoy nature's beauty from a distance. Here's this cool walking bridge. 65 people maximum on the bridge. <laughs> oh, right. <laughs> Okay, so that's the first waterfall, closest to Superior. Oh, wow. What a nice view. So from the bridge, we're going to take the loop path out to Superior. Okay. So this must be some other inlet that comes here. Oh wow, look at all the beautiful driftwood out there. It is an inlet. <laughs> Okay, hey, wow. Look at this. Oh, that's gorgeous. What a beautiful beach. Oh, I bet there's going to be some pretty rocks here. Oh, that's nice. Oh, it's actually a lake because it's cut off from Superior. All right. How beautiful is this? Absolutely gorgeous. Gonna get a quick drink? No laying down. Don't want a wet dog. This is the Presque Isle River coming out here. And from the end of that loop path, you can Walk down this beautiful little beach path and look back up the river. Okay, so even though we're looking into the sun here, this is the Presque Isle, and just around the corner there would be that footbridge that we just walked across. And 
look. Beautiful, beautiful superior. She's so wonderful. It's a busy little place, but not overly crowded. Today is September 7th. There's the bridge. Okay, so mm. we're coming up. There's some slip rock here. Now, kind of looking into the sun. It's about noonish. <laughs> I don't know if you can see across the the river there is the boardwalk and you can see the first waterfall even though it feels like there's a whole bunch of waterfalls here, I guess they're just gonna call them cascades. So this is the little inlet that went down to Lake Superior and it looks like when there's high water that this is also some part of the waterfall and it would come and spill this way. So that's pretty cool. There's all these beautiful layers of rock here. So the East Trail here has been a little bit more challenging. Um, lots of routes to walk over and steep hills. Unfortunately, there were trail closures on the East Trail, preventing us from seeing some of the best views of the waterfalls. One of our objectives for the North Woods was mushroom hunting. We love to photograph mushrooms and the East Trail did not disappoint us. There were mushrooms just about everywhere you looked and they were just so beautiful. You'd hear a big waterfall just down there. Can't wait to see it. But here's kind of what the trail looks like after you kind of come up that initial real steep up onto the ridge. It's pretty flat, pretty easy to hike. And but it's really beautiful. East trail ends at the car bridge. Cross it and then turn right and follow the path back north towards Superior and the parking lot. It was a beautiful trail.